Hello, this is some new Buckeye Burl that we've been milling lately. Haven't made a video on some Buckeye recently, just been in the process of moving to Santa Rosa. So I finally got going up here and showing you a little what I'm doing. Book patch sets cut at a quarter of an inch. Let's see, I got quite a few of them stuck down there. Beautiful stuff. Very flawless. You'll get a couple guitars there. Probably two in that set. Come over here. Here's a book match set to about eight inches wide. Same thing on the, as the other one, about a quarter inch thick. Let's see here, what do we have? About 24 inches. Now some of this stuff is a little punky. I won't focus here, but this area right here is a little soft. I don't know, it's just a little old, I guess. Some of the burls sit around a little longer than they should. It's when you get this brown look here is from when they're sitting, sitting too long. But still some nice looking stuff. Got some over here just stuff the mill. Same thing that I showed you in the first set. Got a handful of those. Then over here I got some sticker getting ready to dry. Some wrap that just hadn't changed color yet. They're on the bottom. And that's what I'm working on right now. My sawmill and some stickers and there's another cant that I'm getting ready to cut up. It's going to produce some nice stuff. And then these are some blocks that I cut as I'm running the mill. Different size blocks here just for different purposes. Turning bowls. It's about a six inch by six inch and maybe five inches wide. Here's a nice piece for like a hollow form. You get the nice burl top there, a natural edge burl top. So you come in through the top side of it, that'd be your natural edge of your vase or whatever you're turning. A lot of people don't like these voids, but I really think that they add character to a turning. There's a nice big about 8 inch by 8 inch block, maybe 12 inches long. Oh, and then here's a sculpture I just did recently. It's a dressage in the wine country. You look out here, this is all season firewood. Right here's a package. Big walnut slab that's getting ready to be shipped out. My friends Bob over here has built this little half a building to work out of. So there's, there's our chip pile, there's our scrap pile waiting to be chipped into that pile. Um, right here you see this is some walnut slabs, those are on eBay right now. And then a bunch of variety of other maple and um, pine slabs there. Well, thanks for watching. Have a good day.